It's Monday, the 25th of March, 2024. Welcome to another edition of Nat's News. Gonna be a bit different today, because I, I just don't fancy running through the mainstream media this morning. I am really tired of it. I'm really bored. Uh, I put out a uh, few posts on X over the weekend, you know, telling people that I am struggling with my mental health and low mood. You know, I'm doing all the right things. I'm exercising. I'm cutting out the drink. I'm getting out in nature. But I can't shift this internal conflict, this kind of low mood, the blues. And I do think it's something to do with the mainstream media. And, you know, I feel like people wake up nowadays in the morning, the first thing they do is put on their phone and they look to the mainstream media to decide what to be outraged about. Obviously, over the weekend, that was about Kate and her cancer diagnosis. Honestly, I saw nothing else at all. And it is depressing as f you know, you want to try and cheer up, you put on your phone and all you see is people reacting to mainstream media news. Now, whether it, it, it's about uh, Kate and the fact that some people believe it was a fake announcement, it was AI or it was or it wasn't or she might have cancer or she might, or, or she could or, or Prince or King Charles, he's also got cancer and then they're going on about some people, it was so rude and they're a conspiracy peers and people should stay out of our life and they shouldn't care about cancer outrage 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 i'm tired i'm tired of um institutions telling us how we feel and how we should be upset um i, I want to uh, you know when i was in the horrible lockdowns and struggling I wanted true freedom. I wanted to wake up in the morning and not care about what the papers were saying and not have my life ruled by other people. And it seems to me so many people that were fighting for that are addicted to their phones, addicted to being outraged, addicted to taking a stance, these polarized viewpoints. And uh, yet I, I just don't understand this obsession now over corruption. I, you know, this this kind of mentality of I need to be a conspiracy theorist and the only thing I care about anymore is, is exploiting uh, the, the these people and saying what's true or what's not. We've no idea of what's true or not. We're never going to know because AI is too good nowadays. I shared a photo myself this morning on X. You know, what I can do with just Snapchat and AI um, you know, and that's just the technology that I can use. Of course, people are going to be able to use fakes. We're never going to know what's real or not anymore. But are you going to spend your whole life obsessing over it? And it's the reaction that I talk about for anyone that's ever been abused or understands narcissism. You know, these abusers, whether they're in the form of a person or an institution or the media or the royals or whoever, they just want a reaction. That's what they want out of you. They're basing you. When they when they put these mistakes, they want people talking. They don't care if it's good. They don't care if it's bad. The way uh, to win is to use the grey rock technique. And uh, that basically means be the most boring, uh, boring item like a grey rock that you can be because... That, that's what they want from you. They want you outraged. They want you reacting. And as long as you're doing that, you're draining your energy, you're demoralized. And that's exactly what I've been doing to myself. And I am tired of it. And I'm sorry that this sounds like a stream of consciousness. And to some people, maybe that's really boring, but I need to get it out there. I need to have a good old rant because I am tired of engaging with the bullshit. I am tired of engaging uh, with, 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 the constant argument and the constant divide and it's doing us no good. This isn't what true freedom uh, is about. Um, and people are saying, oh, well, you're self-censoring yourself if you don't talk about Kate. I'm not self-censoring. I don't care. I want I want the best life I can be. I want my true freedom. I want to get out and start enjoying myself. And uh, that that is not happening while everyone is obsessing over, over exactly 
exactly what the mainstream media prints today or tomorrow. And you know, yes, there might be a narrative. Yes, there might be an agenda. But while we concentrate on that and nothing else, we're doing exactly what they want. We're playing into their hands and we're doing the mainstream media's dirty work for them. So, yeah, I think I've probably just about finished my rant. You can also hear I'm struggling with the the hundred day cough too. Yeah, uh, but no, I didn't have a, a, any jabs or anything else. But I, I I'm tired. I'm tired, and I and I, I want to start doing more positive things. I can't I can't bear to keep focusing on all the negativity and the mainstream media because if they're getting to me, they're getting to everybody else, and the the real irony is the people that are enjoying their life the most are the people that aren't actually focusing on the mainstream media. Call them normies, call them what you like. They're going out there, they're having a nice drink in the pub, they're going to the cinema, they're having fun. And the people that aren't are the people that claim they have true freedom and they're doing nothing but obsess about the mainstream media. So take a bit of your advice if you're a conspiracy theorist. Ignore the TV, ignore the mainstream media, go enjoy your life for a bit because that's exactly what I intend to do because I've had enough. And I'm sure there'll be lots of trolls. I'm sure there'll be lots of people that disagree with me, but I've had a good old rant this morning. I feel better and I'm going to come and come moving forward with much more, much more positive content because otherwise I'm going to drive myself insane. And uh, that's exactly uh, what the people at the top, the corrupt institutions want. And I just want to be happy. So go out there, enjoy the week and stop obsessing over the mainstream media. Bye-bye.